without further ado, okay, I'll introduce our first speaker. His name is Edwin. Edwin will be the speaker that's representing Running Hour. Okay. Hello, gentlemen. I'm Edwin. I'm 30 years young. Just like any of the youth here, I want to achieve a lot in my life. I have a child from here who wants to be a diver. I have a Amanda here who wants to be a lawyer. For me, I want to be a millionaire just like Mr. Richard Branson. I achieved the pinnacle of my life. However, our biggest enemy to success is always this little man who always managed to force his way through to create a wall of distrust and disbelief. We see this happening frequently in our friends. Friends who want to do a full marathon, friends who want to volunteer, friends who want to change a career. But they never do so. All because of this little man, which people turn it as self-limiting belief or fear. Everyone has fears. So do I. My greatest fear is that one day I wake up and I lose all my sight. I fear that I can't even appreciate the sweetness of sunlight through my eyes. Seeing something is always better than nothing. How, how real can this be? In 2002, I was diagnosed with retinitis pigmentosa, a illness that might cause total blindness. Back then, I was. Back then, my world felt shattered and I felt hopeless. So, how do I overcome it? Dale Carnegie famously said Action breeds. Inaction breeds. Doubt and fear. Action breeds confidence and courage. If you want to conquer fear, do not sit at home and think about it. Go out and get busy. Right, go out and get busy. I need to find ways to get around it because I don't want any regrets if one day I lost my sight. In 2012, I came across I first came across running our a club set out for people with special needs to allow them to run. Running is a good activity to make me busy. I believe everyone here feel happy and good after a run. So running gives happiness, running breeds confidence. In running hour, we run in a team. Friends cheer me on. This gave me the motivation to run more. Running hour is not just a club for running, but it provides a platform for people with special needs, guides and volunteers to come together. This provides uh, an opportunity for them for, the, for people with special needs to bond and build friendship with guides and volunteers. This widen their social network. So running hour cannot come a long way without everyone, without guides, without volunteers. Today, running is an excuse for me to come together with friends to run. I hereby invite everyone of you to come forward and join our and meet the